Sometimes, running a family business can be a real challenge, especially when the guys in the warehouse are feeling overworked and unappreciated. But, as usual, I'm up for the challenge, even when the going gets tough. I'm done. Hey, I'm overworked, I'm underpaid, and I'm about to be going fishing. I'm about out of here. Amen. Hey, that's what I'm now, don't get me wrong. Having a booming business is a blessing. Too much of a good thing is too much of a good thing. Hey, it's in the Bible. What y'all talking about? We're tired, we're hungry, and we need snacks. Yeah. Snacks. Lots of snacks. There has got to be a proverb about laborers who have been asked to do too much labor. Or, or potter who has too much pottery to potter. Hey, scripture doesn't lie. Too much work makes Cy a dull boy. Don't even bother. Working model. too hard, probably old or new testament. For even when we were with you, this we commanded you, that if any would not work, neither should he eat. Bingo, the Lord speaketh and winneth again. Back to work, boys. Does anybody know a good book on how to fire a family member? In the duck business, this is what we call a CLM. Career limiting move. It has come to my attention that production is down and goofing off is up. Now what I have here is the 10 commandments of warehouse productivity. Excuse me? I did not get the memo that our new CEO was Charlton Heston. Ten Commandments of the Warehouse? There's not even ten people here to command. I quit. <laughs> and I second that emotion, Jack. <laughs> really? The Lord giveth and the Lord taketh away. They gone. Let's bow. Father, thank you for our journey groups. Father, thank you for this food. Amen. Let's eat. Amen. 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 Now, you may think that that's the end of our happy little workforce. And I admit, for a couple of days, things were a little rough in the warehouse. But what you don't know is that before all this happened, every one of our guys, me included, had committed to get together every Friday morning before work and be in a journey group together. We're on a nine month journey to learn and practice abiding in Christ together. And guess what? We're all finding that God's not done with any of us yet. And the closer we get to him, the closer we get to each other. Well, if y'all excuse me now, I've got some torching to do. Happy, 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 we gone. <laughs>